Then here's the other one. I can probably kill him too from, from far away. I love you. I love you right now. I have a feeling I'm dead here because I can't see. Hello again there, my challenge run, Chesterfields. Welcome back to my challenge run. And we are on mission 89. Actually, before I get started, if there's anybody new to the channel, um, if you're interested in like strategies for missions or weapon stats or reviews or whatever, please check out my playlists on my channel because I don't only do let's plays. I do. I I just had. I've done so much on this game already, like the stats and best weapons and meta and all that stuff that I don't have anything else to do at this point until the next EDF comes out. So if you're interested in that stuff, please check out my my playlist. I broke it up in the, into easy to find sections. Uh, but anyway, so we are on mission 89, which. I think is is going to be not too bad, but you know that always happens, and it usually turns out to be terrible. Um, first of all, it's way too much armor. Um, I'm going to take Ranger because I think Fencer and Wing Diver would be too easy. Same with Air Raider, um, just because like for Air Ra for uh, for Wing Diver you would just take uh, Mirage with uh, the 200% shooting item and a Glyphnir, and that's pretty much mission over. Um, as long as you don't pull too many of the map, of course. And for Fencer, high altitude missiles, you know, pretty simple. And then for Air Raider, you would just pull slowly and use like a 150 or a 105 or Zexar guns to protect yourself, stuff like that. So I just, I want to try, I want to challenge on this mission, so I'm going to take Ranger. I think it's, it's going to be an interesting challenge. Um, as far as weapons, I think MEX is a definite. Like anytime you fight D-Roys, from my opinion, um, MEX is the go-to. Because you want to take the legs out rather than killing the, the beast, as they say, uh, first. Because it just takes too long to kill the beast, and he could be killing you the whole time. And then I need something for range to kill him, because I don't want to kill a D-Roy with uh, MEX Emerald. That, that sounds painful. So I'm thinking Ptarmigan. I hate this gun because you have to pull the trigger. Um, <laughs> but um, I think I need... I mean, I was thinking either that or Stork Machine Gun. Because this thing has a 450 meter range. So at max range, it would be doing... Uh, 150 times 15, so 150 times 10 would be 1,500, and then half of that would be 700, so 2,200 a second for this gun. Um, 2,200 a second versus... This does 4,000 a second, I think, doesn't it? Ptarmigan, yeah, this does twice the damage. Um, it's just easier to defend yourself with the other gun, but I think this will be fine, honestly. And then I'm going to take... I, I, I was thinking either I could take a railgun or helicopter, or I could probably take... I'm thinking I'm taking missile item first to try that, because it'll just make it easier. Plus, I could kill enemies with this thing, too. I have to be very careful not to pull them out. That's the biggest thing, so... Let's get started here and see how this works. Alright, interesting. Destroy enemy robots and recover the urban area. Seven days. Okay, so we need to restore the robots and, and recover the urban areas. So let me grab these these Chaunceys here. This is a difficult mission, but it has to be done. Yes, yeah, so <laughs> it's a difficult mission. So they send six rangers in with shotguns. Like, <laughs> what, what is what is what is this military doing? They don't want to give their bonus out. I'm telling you, man. Like, I I respect them, but they need to they need to respect us. You know, we're giving our lives. Now the thing about this is I need to make sure the D-Roy, uh, Don Donald D-Roy doesn't, Donald D-Roy doesn't destroy, I'm trying to go with all D's but it didn't work, um, Donald D-Roy needs to not go far away so I don't attack, uh, far away, because I mean, I, I have a 5,289,000 meter range with this, this, with this, uh, item, so I need to be careful. Now I need to kill these, these enemies first, probably. Okay. One thing nice about it is we have buildings for now, but they are going to eventually go. Now there's there is the legs of the deer I'd be careful with as well. I mean, as long as I aim this direction, I could probably be safe. So I might just try and aim the correct direction away from the pack, and then just use my missile launcher a lot. But I will need this, of course, to kill the deer Okay, I feel good now. Yeah, the. the See, I don't know if it's just me, or if it's 
if it's you guys too, feel it, but this, this Ptarmigan, it doesn't feel right when I try and pull the trigger as fast. Like, if I mash the trigger, it doesn't seem to, to do the same or the max amount of DPS. Like, it feels like there's a delay or some kind of weird where you have to get the exact right timing. So, that's why I never liked this gun. That's why I wish a Dunkel was the best sniper, but, you know. I need to make sure these guys don't die because it just makes it harder later. My goodness. They're getting bodied. Oh, there's another guy here. Okay, interesting. That's fine. And you feel like you're always reloading with this gun, too. Okay. So that, that was the easy part. So let's uh, recover here. Now, it's all about pulling slowly on this map. And as long as I can do that, I think we'll be fine. There's gonna be there's gonna be some danger sections though where I have to actually uh, pull more than one D-Roy. That could be a little concerning, but I still think we'll be fine. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this uh, now this section over here. Uh, first, I'd like to get a health kit for my guys because I care about them. How's their health? Eh, one dude needs one dude needs it. Um, here's a couple. Okay, so I'll I'll just aim at the side of the, the pack enemies and I think we'll be fine. And I will probably fight over here. That way I can make sure that... Nah. Let me, let me go back this way. I want to make sure I'm seeing what I'm doing because I don't want to pull any more enemies. Okay, so that should be fine. And I gotta see what direction he goes. If he goes left, I need to stop shooting at him. Yeah, he went left, so I need to be careful. So I'm just gonna fire over here. And make sure he fires, make sure he comes back right. Okay, okay, now I have two. That, that should be fine, though. I think it should be fine. And I can kind of aim upward, too, to kind of make sure I'm not aiming in the wrong direction. Alright, guys, you can handle one enemy, surely. I can also shoot the stabby stab legs as well, and that would keep me from getting hit by him. But I need to work on this guy first, because he's, he's more of a threat. Farewell, comrades. My goodness, that guy knew his own death. Very dark. Um, yeah, he needs to go. His legs need to go, at least. Okay, I think his legs are... Oh, my goodness! He stabby-stabbed me. Okay, let's, uh... Let's, uh... I don't want to get bitten by red, because... I think that'd be tough, freeing yourself with a ptarmigan. <laughs> the missile supply. So good. So good. Like, who thought of that line? That was such a good line. No health there. I'm gonna keep, uh, firing over here because I can probably kill the legs as well with my... Can I... Can I please find a health kit here? There we go. Thank you. Oh my goodness. He was dead in the ant's mouth and the ant, man, mouth, the ant was, still, was still attacking him. That is so dark. Okay, well, we have only one Charlie left, and that's that's a scary idea. But, either way, um, I knew they were going to be gone eventually. Let's get some health here. Yes, you did. Good job. Good job. Good job. Yeah, I, I want you guys to look up online. Crystal, Crystal Pony's... Crystal's... Crystal's Pony Adventure or something, and good job. Those, those words... You won't regret it. it. It's it's the best thing you ever hear, and you'll probably want to like record it for bedtime to listen to like ASMR or whatever it's called. Is that what it's called, ASMR? Um, but yeah, you just want to put that on repeat and then just listen to that over and over again. You'll be happy. And when you wake up thinking, man, I I am a very I did a very good job yesterday. I I, I feel like I'm very gratified. Okay, come on. Okay, you're getting close now all of a sudden. You think it's stuck outside the map a little bit. Which, my guess is the reason they get stuck out the map is because um, they... Oh my goodness. Is because they're trying to walk away and they can't walk any further away because they're um, at the edge of the edge of their limits. And because of that, they just get stuck in the animation of trying to walk backwards. That's my guess. But you know me, I have, I know nothing and I speak a lot of things. 
thinking I know something. So that's that's a thing. One thing good about this mission is you get a lot of items, so the submarine carrier siren was attacked by mothership. I don't really care about the items. I just care about his health, so is Epimetheus the only one left? I don't the thing is I don't see any health. It's crazy. I realize how often I say crazy, I need to tame it down a bit. The little slow tip tips in my feet sometimes. It's very rhythmic. Okay, that should be fine, I guess. I mean, ultimately, I'd like to get him to full health, but, you know, we, we don't have time as a ranger to collect all these health, my goodness. Like, you know, there's there's a war to be won and a bonus to be had. Now, I usually like to go far left side next because of the fact that... Now, what I can do is just just barely, barely hit the edge of the enemies and then wait till they get closer to me because I don't want to keep firing missiles now because that will cause more enemies to come at me, which I don't want. I may not hit anything because of the, the buildings. I think that's what happened, so we'll do it again. One of those is definitely going to hit now. There we go. Okay, there we go. I'm just going to wait a little bit here because I don't trust... That's the thing, like, I don't know if, if a vehicle would be better here because I could kill the Deroids really fast from far away, but I don't, you know, I don't know. Okay, I need to get him now. See, like, right now, if he died, which he's about to be dead, if they're firing at me like that, I can't handle that. So I need to, I need to kill his legs, and I need to kill him fast. Oh my goodness. I think, I think we're better now. I think we're better now. Okay, that's a little scary. Oh my goodness. This, this could be the end of me right here. This could be the end of me right here. Why did I roll into my missile? I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. So, what have we learned from this? I don't know. Confound it all. What have we learned from that? Do I need a vehicle? I don't think I need a vehicle. Um, hmm. What have we learned from that? I think we learned that... I think I'd rather have a TMZ Stork, TZ Stork, than that to defend myself. It's a little bit easier to defend myself with. Um, so I think I might change that out. But other than that, I think what I have is what I have. That was a very profound statement, but... I think what I'm going to try and do at the beginning here is try and pull two sets at the beginning just to make it a little quicker. Let's see how that feels. And, the and uh, then go from there. Because I think that this I could probably go a little faster at the beginning because I have a very strong weapon here. Secure our homeland for humankind. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, when they get close, it's, it's crazy. Like, sometimes you don't know what they're going to do. And I need to not hit myself as well. That's important. Like, do I want to attack the deer right now or attack the head? I mean, this isn't terrible, but... There's behind me, spider. Okay, I saw that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, there's three of them. My, that's what I said I wanted to do, so we'll see what happens. Let's get, let's walk this direction. Oh my goodness. They're dying. That's always the issue, like the little, the little tiny dudes that distract you. My goodness, what do you want from me? Oh dear, I, I definitely, I wanted to pull more and I did it, so. Quit the stabby stab. Okay, he got me. They shouldn't be able to stab me in the red ant's mouth. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Still legs left. I need to be careful. I guess I'll just keep going this direction. Oh, dear. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm definitely dead. Well, okay, I know I can't pull that step fast. So what I think I'll do is... If I die here, which... 
it's looking that way. I should go this direction because they're going the opposite direction here on me. Let's uh go this way. Yeah, they're gonna be all dead by the time I get there. All right, come on, come on, juggling me. Quit juggling me. I think it's over now. There's a health arm shot. Oh dear, he's dead. Good job, you took all my health the way that I got from you. Perfect. What do you want? Oh my goodness. <laughs> that was right to the brain. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take it slowly and cut to when I get to the part I died on last time. Okay, we're back. I didn't really change anything. Um, one thing I'm going to do differently instead is I'm going to attack on the far right side. And that way they'll be a little bit further away from me. And hopefully not have too many enemies come after me. I do have a lot of guys left, which is good here. That should pull. Okay, good. Now, the thing is, like, just realizing how strong these enemies are, I really need to pull slowly, like, more than usual. Usually I pull, you know a whole D-Roy at a time, or maybe two, but I can't do that with Ranger, I realize, so. And also by pulling far away and being far away on the map myself. Those guys, they're so good. Um, but by being far away on the map will give me more time to attack the D-Roys from far away and kill the small enemies quicker, and I just need to be careful with that, I think. So that's what I'm going to try and do. Those Rolly Balls are so bad because they they get pushed around so much, of course, and because of that, it's so hard to kill them. Now, what is, is this D-Roy getting close? No, he's not. So I'm not going to attack him because he's in a dangerous spot. I think he might pull more enemies. Let's just kill these other enemies still. Still have three or four left. Oh my goodness, they're so good. They're so good at that. I love it. The armor is damage, yes. I need to not roll. Like, I've done that before where I roll. Okay, he's getting close. I need to attack his legs now. I need to not pull the enemies behind him because I have a range, like I said, for the map. I can pull the map if I needed to, which I don't want to, but... Okay, I think... I think we're better off now. <clears throat> so, now I can attack these... And I still have a few enemies I need to kill. Where are you? Oh my goodness! See, he, he even waited. You see that? He waited. His timing was perfect. Like, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Oh dear. Why are these coming? Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, it's over. Yeah, it's over. I don't know how that happened, but I guess the rolly ball got pushed across the map with a missile. So we're just going to have to... I mean, I guess we're going to try, but I'm not feeling it here. Let me walk into a post. I always like doing this. Yeah, we are we're so dead. It's not even it's not even like we're we're negative death here. <laughs> yep. It's just uh I mean, I'll try it out, but yeah, right. Look at all his enemies too. Yeah, it's over. Okay. All right, new plan. I have a brute and I have the MEX Emerald and the Tarmigan. I think the Tarmigan's better because of the fact that it it's a better um easier to kill a Deroys with. Um, right now, I'm trying to... There's a D-Roy, like, right here. Really close, I think, is the next best one to pull, so... That's what I'm trying to do here. It's a little scary. Because a lot of times I can't see. I do have the helicopter, but... But I, I just don't want to get too close. Because it depends how the D-Roy moves. He moves backwards, and I can't fight him, and then I'm stuck out near close to the enemy, so... Um, I might be able to snipe those tadpoles in the air as well. Come on, my goodness, what is going on? I need to build C. Like, he's right here, I think. We're almost in the enemy's range. I'm so scared here. Maybe if I can, maybe if I can yes, eventually snipe him, if I keep breaking these buildings, it might be good. Alright, there's another building down. Yeah, I can see him now. Yes, sir. 
Which is it? Plan A, Plan X, Plan Z. There we go. That had to have hit. Yeah, that hit something. Okay, did the Dero see us? I mean, I'm fine if it's just enemies that see us. That's actually... Yeah, that's perfect, actually. Because there's a Dero I wanted to kill. But... I pulled a few enemies instead, or maybe just one enemy, I don't know, we'll see, but... Need to be careful, I don't want to, like, shoot something in the background and mess everything up here. Oh my goodness, like that? It's like I just pulled one enemy, but at least I can see the D-Roy right now that I want to snipe. This is the one I want to get next, so... I'm just gonna s tack his little tiny little, little leggy leg right there. And nothing else. And that should be fine. I might be able to, to use the brute to kill him too. I think now it's safe to, to missile him. I'm surprised if there's no other small enemies that come, but looks like no other enemies came, so that's perfect. Oh, no, no, never mind. Here they come. They're just a little slower. That was a dangerous shot. I knew it too, and I don't know why I did it anyway, but. Let's kill these out first. I think that's important. That d -Roy is a tiny one. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't know if you can actually pull the big d -Roy in the back. Oh, I need to get into my Brute now. Cause he'll, oh my goodness, there's two of them. He'll die quickly though, I think. Alright, come on, get in here. Where are you? Yeah, stay in front of me, please. Please stay in front of me. Shouldn't take long to kill him. Yeah, that's very quick. And here's the other one. I could probably kill him too from, from far away. I love you. I love you right now. I have a feeling I'm dead here because I can't see. Seriously, this, like, of all the angles, of all... I don't understand that. Like, do they know? Th are they that smart? Crap. And he's behind me too. Now I can't even turn to, to shoot him. I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Oh, my goodness! Of, I feel like... I feel like it's the enemy's trap. I'm trying to shoot. I really am. I really am trying to shoot. Wow, and it just blew it up. You know what? Like, just, just spit in my face. Just spit in my face. Just do it. Wow.